it's Alex and I'm here today at Milton Keynes British Leyland Rally run by Tom Morley I'm in Peggy today I was going to bring her over but it's got to be Peggy isn't it so here's Peggy showing off her engine again <laughs> and we have a, another lady owner next to us with this lovely Reynard vehicle very nice engine bay in this as well look at the leads they're like see-through they're really cool there's lots of nice logos here today there's so many we couldn't fit them all in a row and we've ended up having to put some right over there behind some land crafts <laughs> Andrew's here in his recent purchase and this car got very confused I thought it was Peggy coming in <laughs> it's another Emridge in blaze but this one's a four-door This is one we've seen before. We like this one. We like the interior of that. Go have a look at it again. It's a lovely interior. You probably can't see because of the reflections, but lovely colour. This one we've seen recently as well at the Allegra Spares Day. I think he's got the same colour interior in this now. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> that is a nice colour. Sort of burnt orange. Don't think it would look good. It wouldn't look good in Peggy, would it? But... Allegro bums. Look how flat this bum is. The equips here. Very cool. I don't think I've seen this fandom plough before. It's very nice. Glittery in gold. Look at that interior. You wouldn't think that was an Allegro, would you? <laughs> Come on. Look, looking at this angle, that does not look like an Allegro. It's fantastic. Picnic tables. Armrest. Don't have things like that in Peggy. Oh, lots of insulation in this engine bay. Shiny alternator. And a random child. Lots of badges. I don't think this is the same. This isn't the same equip that we saw at Gaiden, is it? This is a different one. It's another equip. No, it's a different one. Do you like the seats? The two door. Fancy rocker cover. My mum had a rocker cover like that on her. Allegra. <laughs> Do you like an estate? I really would like an estate. I'm very handy. I've been borrowing an estate car. Not as exciting as an Allegro. Rather boring. Well, it's not that boring, but it's a Jaguar. And it's an estate and it's very handy. So I wouldn't mind an Allegro estate. Look 
Peggy again. <laughs> That's Claire's Allegro Vermilion. Lovely. I do like this. It's one of my favourite series threes. She's got a nice clean engine bay. Don't know why she hasn't opened it up. <laughs> It's so nice, even the little bees enjoying it, look. <laughs> I've come all the way to the end of the field to just have a quick look at the Van and Flora Allegro. Because this is a little Van and Flora owners club stand. So, there's a couple of Allegros here. I like that green one, I've not seen that one before. <laughs> okay, let's go and see <laughs> what Peggy's won. This year, there's obviously so many beautiful vehicles. Previously, we've just had a winner and runner up in each class. Um, but this year I decided to do a winner and two highly commended awards just to recognise that there's so many lovely cars here um, so we could give a few more awards out. So in the Allegro class, first place, uh, sorry, the two highly commended awards go to CGN 878X, which I believe is Claire O'Sullivan. Would you like to come forward? Um, and the second highly commended award goes to JFV842W, which is the gold band all bass 1500, which is Anthony Thursday. Uh, and the winner in the Allegro class goes to WVY599M, which is Alex's little uh, two-door 1300. Oh. Well done. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, I'm shaking. <laughs> Some absolutely beautiful cars over there. Uh, there's two highly commended. One is the beautiful minivan, which is YGJ848G. I've never seen a minivan. It doesn't look like it's a van. Picture. Well done. Yeah. And then we've got another highly commended, which well also goes to a mini, but someone that's again made an outstanding commitment, oh, bought the car from Thailand, which I think is fantastic, which is G580UEA, which is a mini 30, which the Philip Green's family have owned from brand new. And then the winner in that class is an absolutely outstanding Rover PC, which is XYU 201 Oh, the yellow one. Which is Richard. Richard. There he is. I've seen the people looking at It was so close. Well done. Thank you. And then we've got one last award, which is the Best in Show Award. Um, and that comes with a nomination to go on the Maguire's Club sh Showcase at the NEC, which I'm sure a few of you know that I've done in my time and very much enjoy. Um, and it goes to an absolutely beautiful uh, Rover 420, uh, owned by Matt Lynch, which is S353EGW. 6,000 miles from you, it looks like it's just rolled off the line. <laughs> That's when it gets trailer, yeah. All right. So, thank you very much, guys, for attending. I hope you've all had a lovely day. Thank you, Sarah, for doing all the awards and helping me out. I've been told to around the cars for you. There's one last award to present that Ian and Dawn are going to 
choose, so they're going to nip round in a minute and choose that side. Chosen. Oh, we've cho yeah. you've chosen, yeah. so there yeah. we go. Yeah. Right, <laughs> announce the winner here. It is, I can't remember the numbers very well. It's LRX 19P. Oh. Oh. Goodness. Hey! Oh. There we go. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> so you're all free to just enjoy a little bit more time at the show, go home, whatever you'd like to do, and thanks again for coming. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> do you feel like you're seeing double yet? It's like looking in a mirror. Bertha's come to see Peggy. We're going for a, an Allegro sandwich and we're using P4s as bread. <laughs> oh, and Mavis is coming. <laughs> Here she is. <laughs> this is what us rover owners get up to. <laughs> so quiet. You sure there's an engine in there? Is there? <laughs> oh yeah, there it is. I can hear it now. There we are, Bertha, Peggy and Mavis all together. <laughs> Should be Jesse in the middle really, shouldn't it? <laughs> and we got a P6 in the background as well. What more could you want? We've got four members of the P4 Guild here, all in an Austin Allegro. Yay! <laughs> Yay! We're all going for a ride. <laughs> 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 this is just pure madness. <laughs> I don't even know where we're going. <laughs> Run Tom over. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even flinch. Did not. <laughs> no, it didn't night shoot. Didn't even flinch. <laughs> well, that's really yeah. Nice. yeah. <laughs> I didn't see that one turn up. <laughs> and it's really bouncy in the back, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Mind your head. I don't know the area, so I'm just going to randomly drive around some roundabouts, I think. Oh, there's plenty of those. Yeah. Roundabout city. Yep. <laughs>
don't remember those. I didn't have a, didn't have a car when I was a kid, so yeah. Oh, are you on horses and cars today, Dave? No, not that old, yeah. <laughs> As I say, the other day, as I say, the other the other place where they, they thought I was alive in 1947, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I, know, I, look, I know my wife always tells me I look old, but... Yeah. That's nice, isn't it? That is nice, yeah. The way it took that bump and I thought it was really good. Yeah? yeah that ridge in the road, which has kind of that round about, but it absorbed it and the front went up and then came down to the control banner. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> now the fun bit is getting out. 